could be a bit of a hiring tactic. Um, the high tech industry has got, taken a lot of hits recently about their employment policies, how they treat their employees. Netflix uh, reportedly is a high, highly charged environment. They have an unlimited vacation policy, but it, you know, critics say that people don't take the vacation because they, um, there's pressure to get the work done. I don't think it's necessarily a broader shift in policy, but it will put pressure on other companies because Netflix is a high profile company. It, almost all policies require a certain size company. The smallest I've seen is that a minimum requirement of 50 employees. So it's going to be for the larger companies. But what happens at the larger companies puts pressure on the smaller companies because you have to attract talent. Smaller companies need to uh, have good employees as well. So they're going to have to mirror some of the policies that the larger companies do have. The There's a lot of liberalization of uh, employment policies at the local level and the state level. I don't see much happening in Congress anytime soon because there's been such a deadlock. Um, the, the politics of, and, and, and the outlook of the parties in control will not pass any paid, in my view, pass any paid leave, no matter what it's for, maternity, paternity, or sick leave, anytime soon.